Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have completely severed their ties to the royal family and will never return, a royal author has claimed. Three years ago, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex grabbed headlines when they officially stepped down. As working members of the British monarchy, the pair left the UK and relocated to California, where they are currently raising their two children, Archie and Lilibet. Shortly after making their exit, they inked lucrative money-spinning deals with streaming giants Netflix and Spotify. The latter contract, rumored to be worth $20 million, collapsed in the summer. The couple also stepped back into the spotlight. With their infamous Oprah Winfrey interview, and of course the release of Harry's bridge-burning memoir Spare, which, fittingly, spared no detail about his feud with estranged brother Prince William. It is looking less and less likely that Harry, and former actress Meghan, will retreat and be welcomed back into the fold. According to writer Clive Irving, who penned 2020 biography The Last Queen, about Her Majesty, the late Queen Elizabeth II, Harry and Meghan's celebrity, used to rest on the former's connection to the royal family, but they've now been celebrities in their own right for so long, that they don't need to trade on that anymore, that's no longer part of their lives, Irving said. Harry and Meghan's future will be seen as completely independent. Of the monarchy, they are no longer attached to it in any meaningful way. And I don't think they can get back into it in any meaningful way either. Earlier this week, an olive branch of sorts was extended when it is believed Harry celebrated Charles' birthday over. The phone, although the king's youngest son didn't fly over for the festivities, he's understood to have made a transatlantic call to his father. Perhaps he's not too hung up after all. The milestone occasion was a fairly dialed-in affair. Aside from ceremonial gun salutes, including at the Tower of London, before the monarch reportedly enjoyed a private dinner with other family members and friends. In May, Harry attended the coronation of King Charles III and Queen Camilla at Westminster Abbey alone, without Meghan or their children.